Ken, I need you to just hear me out on this, okay? So, um, because I live very near the nationally recognized home of Sasquatch, and because I have the leisure time during the day to go portal hunting, I'm gonna need you to send me that pantsometer. What you can see here is the main reason that Sasquatch abducts humans is for our pants. If in fact Sasquatch is abducting humans for their pants, does that affect the equipment we need for our Sasquatch hunt? Is there some kind of pantsometer? Or something. Everyone should always have a pantsometer in their toolkit. Anytime anything ends in ometer, you should always add that to your toolkit. I feel like that might um, speed along the process a little bit. Hey sis, I got your message and I was just packaging up the pantsometer for you. But I thought it would make sense to give you a quick instructional video for you, for you since it's a little complicated. Uh, the first thing you want to do is go ahead and plug it in so you get the beep beeps and the boop boops. And then you take the clips here and you connect these up to the pants legs. And then if um, you have pants legs to connect them to, then you know that you have a pair of pants. Did you invent that pants a meter? Because I'm going to tell you right now, that's not what a pants a meter needs to do. A pants a meter, Ken, needs to lead me to where all the pants are. Also, how useful is it going to be if I have to plug it in? in a different dimension. We don't know what their electricians do there. We don't even know if they have electricians. No, it has to be battery operated and it has to detect pants in the woods in large quantities. I'm sorry. Well, as we know, the beep beeps and boop boops are very important in detecting large quantities of pants. However, if you do need a portable pantsometer, I have one right here. Oh yeah, 10% off blue jeans at Ross. I have that super cool work of art. You see that? That was done by an artist who was abducted by Sasquatch and taken to a different dimension. Well, I, I'm probably lying on that one. <laughs> okay, I'm lying about that, but I do need the pants a meter. My daddy rolled his own smokes from Prince Albert in the can. My brothers tried it too, it made them feel just like a man. <laughs> but when I tried so hard to light that humble roll your own. I gagged and coughed and sputtered, and the smoke blew me back home. <laughs> she wrote that. <laughs> that was my song. It's also true.